our big story at 10, add another name to the list of people hoping to take Reed Ripple's seat in Wisconsin's 8th Congressional District. A local veteran has announced his run today at an event in Green Bay. NBC 26's Ashley Barnes was there for the announcement and explains more about Mike Gallagher's reasons for running. It was a packed house with standing room only as many came out to see Mike Gallagher announce his candidacy for the 8th Congressional District. It was a moment for all ages, filling Gallagher's pizza to support a native Wisconsin veteran. The afternoon started with an introduction by his father, saying Mike Gallagher will be the best man for the job because he truly cares about the country, the same reason he joined the Marines. He looked at me and he said, Dad, you name one job that I can get coming right out of college where 100 young men and women's life depend on my skill and intelligence, and I will take it. Otherwise, I'm going to join the Marines. And when it was time for Mike Gallagher to speak, the crowd ready to hear what he had to say. The people of the 8th District deserve leaders who are willing to fight every single day. And fighting for our country's defense, one of the main points Mike Gallagher spoke about this evening, saying it's connected to our country's economics. Five years from now, we're going to be spending more money on interest to service our debt than we're going to be spending on our national defense. And he's not concerned about his lack of experience. People want new leaders. They want a new generation of leaders. They're tired of the status quo. So from college to the military, and now announcing his candidacy, Gallagher's goals are all about making a difference. And Gallagher says his next step will be visiting the 11 counties in the district to prove he's ready and the right man to earn the job. Keeping you connected, Ashley Barnes, NBC 26. And since Breed Ribble announced he will not be seeking re-election, the candidate list includes Republican State Senator Frank Lassay, who also recently announced his intentions to run for the seat, as well as Wendy Gribben of Marinette County and Republican Terry McNulty of Forestville.